it's not surprising that the artists who have today are performing and tomorrow they are forgotten. No impact, no influence. But the damage they are causing on our cultural values is one that is going to live on because young people are watching and they think it's fashionable that they should behave the way they do. Many of our artists today are not contributing positively in so far as protection, promotion of our values, cultural values, is concerned. You are coming on stage dressed in a totally an African indecent way and you think that's right. And our people are, are, are being misled. Let them be graceful, but not a disgrace to our society. Our artists, they come and dress half naked. Children are there at home watching them. And tomorrow, you know, children learn by what? By coping. Tomorrow they will also be, begin behaving like those artists. Is this what our artists want, the, the, the new generation or generation after them to copy? The promotion of nudity is totally an African, absolutely an African. You'd have to be crazy to promote nudity as if it's a way of life that Ugandans are proud of. Uh, Ministry of Ethics and Integrity, the two should work together to give guidance to this nation. What you are seeing now, taking pride in nudity, uh, in this sense, uh, are things which, if we uh, don't have them controlled, will completely uh, uh, damage this country's interests. That's why we are appealing to government to sit back and uh, be committed to giving guidance. The good thing with guidance is that all of us now grow up, do our work, knowing what is acceptable and what is not acceptable. The nation, citizens need to know the do's and don'ts of our existence. But we are losing that track, and in the process, of course, you can see that uh, anything goes. Tomorrow you'll find it possible, somebody just choosing to go naked because it is his or her right. Our view is that our artists should promote our side of life, our artists should be champions of what is good in our society, our artists should be the, the, the fountain of honor when it comes to defending interests of this nation.